Hey everyone, it's Ellen. You know how much I love music, and I love sharing stories about amazing people. Today, it's all about Udo Jürgens. He was a true music legend. Born in Austria, Udo took the world by storm with his incredible talent. Udo wasn't just a singer, he was a songwriter, a composer, and a pianist. Talk about a triple threat. He was like the energizer bunny of music. He never stopped. For over five decades, Udo created hit after hit. He touched so many lives with his music. Udo's music wasn't just catchy, it was full of emotion. He sang about love, about life, and about the world around us. His songs were like stories set to music. And boy, could he tell a story. Udo's music connected with people on a deep level. It made you feel something. OK, let's talk about some of Udo's biggest hits. Get ready to sing along. One of his most famous songs is Merci Chérie. It won the Eurovision Song Contest in 1966. And let me tell you, winning Eurovision is a big deal. It's like the Olympics of music. Then there's Griechischer Wein, which means Greek wine. This song is a classic. It's all about longing for home and loved ones. It's impossible to listen to it without feeling a little bit nostalgic. Trust me, you'll be singing it for days. Another favorite is Abba Bitamit San. This song is pure fun. It's about a group of older ladies who love their cake with lots of whipped cream. Udo had a way of finding humor in everyday life and his music always brought a smile to your face. These are just a few of Udo's countless hits. He wrote over 1,000 songs. His music has stood the test of time. People of all ages still enjoy his music today. That's the mark of a true legend. Let's go back to 1966 for a second. Picture this, Udo Jürgens on stage at the Eurovision Song Contest. The lights are bright, the crowd is going wild, and he's singing his heart out. He's performing Merci Chérie, a beautiful ballad about lost love. The song captivated Europe. Udo's voice was smooth like butter. The melody was unforgettable, and the lyrics were pure poetry. When the votes came in, it was a landslide victory for Udo. He had won Eurovision. It was a historic moment for Udo and for Austria. The win catapulted Udo to international fame. Merci, Chérie became a global hit. It was translated into many languages, and it introduced the world to the magic of Udo Jürgens. Eurovision was just the beginning of an incredible journey for him. Udo wasn't afraid to speak his mind. He used his music to address important social and political issues. He sang about peace, about environmentalism, and about social justice. He believed in making the world a better place. One of his most powerful songs is Ein Ehrenwertes Haus, which means a respectable house. It's a protest song against prejudice and discrimination. The song sparked controversy when it was released. But Udo stood his ground. He believed in using his voice for good. Udo's willingness to tackle tough topics made him even more relatable to his fans. He wasn't just an entertainer. He was a thoughtful artist who cared about the world. He used his platform to raise awareness about important issues. And he inspired others to do the same. Section 5. A Legacy Remembered. The DAS Tribute Show. Fast forward to today and Udo's music is still going strong. In fact, there was a fantastic tribute show called DAS. It celebrated Udo's life and music. The show featured some amazing artists, all paying homage to the great Udo Jürgens. One of the highlights of the show was seeing Udo's son, John Jürgens, perform his father's songs. Talk about talent running in the family. 
John has an incredible voice, and you could feel the emotion in every note he sang. It was a beautiful tribute to his father. The DAS show was a testament to Udo's enduring legacy. His music continues to inspire and entertain people of all ages. It was a night filled with joy, with memories, and with the timeless music of Udo Jürgens. Section 6. John Jürgens Carrying the torch John Jürgens isn't just Udo's son. He's a talented musician in his own right. He's following in his father's footsteps, but with his own unique style. John's music is a blend of pop, rock, and a touch of his father's classic sound. It's clear that John was influenced by his father, but he's not trying to be Udo. He's carving his own path in the music industry, and he's doing an amazing job. John's music is heartfelt, catchy, and full of life just like his dad's. It's wonderful to see John carrying on his father's legacy. He's keeping Udo's music alive for a new generation. And he's making his own mark on the world of music. I can't wait to see what he does next. Section 7. The Power of Music. Udo's Enduring Influence. Udo Jürgen's music had a way of bringing people together. No matter your age, your background, or where you came from, his songs had something for everyone. He sang about universal themes that resonated with people all over the world. His music transcended borders and languages. It connected with people on a human level. That's the power of music. It has the ability to unite us, to inspire us, and to make us feel alive. And Udo's music did all of that and more. Udo's influence can still be felt today in the music of other artists. Many musicians cite him as an inspiration. His timeless melodies and heartfelt lyrics continue to influence songwriters and composers around the world. Section 8. A Timeless Treasure Udo's impact on future generations. Udo Jürgens left behind a rich musical legacy. His songs will continue to be enjoyed for generations to come. They're like a time capsule, capturing the emotions and experiences of a particular era. But they're also timeless. His music will introduce future generations to his incredible talent. They'll discover the joy, the sorrow, and the beauty of his songs. And they'll be touched by his music, just like we were. That's the magic of a true legend. Udo's music reminds us that music is a gift. It's a gift that keeps on giving. It has the power to transport us back in time. It can make us feel happy, sad, nostalgic, and everything in between. And that's a gift worth cherishing. Section 9. Conclusion Udo Jürgens, forever in our hearts. Udo Jürgens was more than just a musician. He was an icon. He was a voice for the people. And he was a master storyteller. His music will continue to inspire, to entertain, and to remind us of the power of music. So the next time you hear a song by Udo Jürgens, stop and really listen. Let his music wash over you and remember the incredible legacy of this music legend. Udo, thank you for the music. You will never be forgotten.